So are you singing songs of the broken and how do you lead people in worship through their brokenness? I believe that brokenness is from our deep fellowship with God. It's in the depths of what we experience each day. And we find that God causes us to sing in that moment, even at times when we can't utter a word. And the greatest thing about leading worship is that you're giving nuance and voice and music for people to have vehicle to their prayers, that they can send their prayers, even if that brokenness is difficult for them to sing a note. Because our fellowship with God brings us back to faith in Him. And you as a worship leader can help provide those guardrails for people in their brokenness. And even like looking at my brokenness as a worship leader, I'm just as broken in my own way, maybe different from somebody else, but I can lead out of that brokenness knowing that, you know, God's word that was implanted to my heart, it gives me reason to believe his salvation, his refuge, his strength, the joy that I find, the mercy that he draws me in deeper into his side. That's what deep fellowship, that's what deep worship, that's what leading out of brokenness is about. And I believe that when people see us in our own brokenness and that transparency, that alone leads worship because it tells people that you're real.